and welcome to this week's weekly update brought to you from Hadley Eyestone this week because uh, this commemorates um, the Battle of Barnet in 1471 uh, which of course makes it uh, 550 years ago uh, this year um, since uh, one of the uh, defining uh, battles in the uh, War of the Roses so, uh, what's been happening this week? Well, I've um, managed to get uh, a ticket to uh, go on the uh, walk with the Ramblers uh, this coming Sunday, which uh, uh, was a result because they only had uh, 11 tickets available. Um, it was a bit like going to a gig, yes, yeah, so I was sat there at like uh, 9.59, pressing refresh a lot on the computer uh, until the ticket came up and then I just grabbed it. Uh, lucky there's no seating plan or anything like that and it's free so um, yeah I'm, I'm considering myself lucky because an hour later there was a message on the WhatsApp group saying that um, the um, the wall was full so yeah result on that one uh, unfortunately uh, well it depends on your perspective unfortunately the birds that I thought were looking for a nest have built a nest and um, are uh, now rearing a brood of uh, starling chicks in uh, uh, right, right in the corner of the roof. Um, they don't seem to come into the loft, which is good. Um, but um, I have wo I'm walking up every morning at dawn by little chirping birds. Uh, so uh, it's not quite up with the lark, it's up with the starlings. So according to the RSPB I've got three weeks of this before they fledge and I hope, I hope they don't have another brood. Um, but um, they're quite cute. Well, the starlings are quite cute. They keep giving, they keep looking at me every time they go uh, in, in cause they land just above the window and have a have a, have, a, have a look round, give me the eye, and uh, and then um, then go and feed the chicks. Um, so um, yeah, hopefully another two weeks or so, and then we'll um, we'll be because yeah we're probably about done about a week by now. So um, that's that. Um, yeah, so all good, starlings. And yes, so I'm having a, a bit more um, variety now than um, walking and cycling. Oh, and I went and got myself a new lawnmower, yes, uh, which is amazing. Uh, it, it, it actually cuts the grass uh, without destroying the place or destroying itself. Um, and I got one, I paid an extra £4 and got one that uh, sucked uh, the grass up. Um, that was amazing I, I got like three grass boxes full uh, and um, it now doesn't look a total tip after I've mowed the lawn so yes so lawn mowers um, walking and uh, birds that's been an eventful week so until next week uh, goodbye <laughs>